Aloha, and here we are, day three. Two things come to mind. Two things. First of all, doing this is a good thing for many reasons. For those of you just tuning in, this is my third day doing the Master Cleanse. I recommend you start in day one to see the context of what I'm doing. My camera has a five minute limit in shooting 4K, which is kind of annoying. So, but there's another side of that. It's to force me to be concise, which is not a bad thing. Uh, many people have told me that I have the gift of gab, and I'm gonna put up my phone, and I'm gonna try to be concise here. Here's the other thing. It's hard to talk about the master cleanse and not talk about two things. It's always two things with me. <laughs> not really. Um, two things. The two things are uh, f food and cravings and poop. It's hard not to talk about the master cleanse and avoid poop. I'm, I was thinking about this before I turned the camera on. And... I had a tiny breakthrough. This is a very tiny. Don't get excited, but um, or get excited. I don't. I don't care. It's cool. I, I want you to do you, really. Please do you. There's only one of you, and thank you for being you. Um, I am choosing to look at it as an opportunity to cultivate self-acceptance in the world around the way our body digests food. We actually, at least in the United States. We have a lot of, I'm sure in, in many parts of the world, I can, I mean, based on the, the lovely people I've got to know in an in international sphere, uh, there's shame around digestion, especially in the States. There's shame around poo. There's shame around um, poo ending up in places you don't want it, right? Um, but the reality is that it's just a part of life. You don't have to be ashamed about it. Uh, you know, it occurs to me it's in an odd way. It, it's kind of like how we talk about death, which also has a lot of dis, dysfunctional language around it in the United States. And that's really beyond the scope of this video, obviously. Um, this is what I learned about uh, the Master Cleanse today. I feel like I've hit my stride. When you do a saltwater cleanse, which is something that they recommend you do on the Master Cleanse, it's basically you take 30 ounces of water, you take basically a liter of water, well, I supposed to take like 32 ounces? Yeah, which is about a liter, a liter is 33 point, uh, um, and then you put two teaspoons, two galactic imperial teaspoons of sea salt, not iodized salt, don't do iodized, don't do it. Um, and you put it in, because the iodized will mess you up and you'll explode. Um, the sea salt will flow through your body much better. I don't know why, but it's... Um, and it, your body can't absorb it, so... It just washes your insides. I'm just gonna... I'm gonna say about that, just be careful about that. That's all I'm gonna say about that. Um, so day three is good. Didn't need, didn't take a nap today, so I think yesterday I would probably took a nap because I was I was fighting off this this cold. Um, don't think it's COVID. I don't think it's COVID. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it for day three. If you have any questions about what I'm doing, please let me know. Hopefully, I kept this under the five and a half minute ish limit that my Olympus camera imposes for 4K video. But I wanted you guys to get the highest quality video. From me. Thank you once again, and please let me know if you have any questions on this. And thanks for watching.